what's up guys it's september 25th and i've just been kind of going around getting the last few things done here and there but i wanted to show you a little project i've been working on in the last video if you want to go back and watch it i actually built a a big platform and a stand that had steps going up to it for a muddy bull blind but in this video i was going to show you how i built like a smaller version for a um, ground blind to go on top of so I'm going to kind of walk you through, give you an idea of like what I did for this. And uh, if you're interested in building one of these, it's pretty simple, really. I mean, you can actually get some of these brackets on Amazon for like 50 bucks. I don't think they make this platform anymore that I used, so just keep that in mind. But I'll show you around and give you an idea how I built it and uh, see what you think. So what I did on this one was a little bit different than the other one because the Muddy Bull Blind actually has a floor of its own. But on a ground blind, there's usually not a floor that's in it. So what I did was, is I actually built this platform. Um, it was it was actually a kit. It was a metal kit. You put this platform together. It's got like four by four uh, metal um, channels that you put four by fours into. But on this actual stand, I used four by sixes, and I notched the top. And uh, all together, this um, these uh, four by sixes are seven foot long. So this is approximately seven foot tall. So on the platform itself I used two by fours for the frame and I built this frame like the exact size um, to fit on top of the metal frame and the metal frame is five by five and this deck that I built on top is a six by six so if I use a five by five um, blind it'll actually just set you know really nice on top and I can bolt it or screw it down um, for the legs I actually did um, two by sixes X braces and that makes it like super sturdy for like this height it's just like that thing is like it's pretty much rock solid I mean it's sitting there it has no wobble to it or nothing on the ladder itself I built it out of two by fours I think it's an eight foot two eight foot um, two by fours and like eight um, two foot two by fours so I just built a ladder I didn't screw it on yet or anything because I want to be able to move it around depending on where the, the blind zipper door is so where I was sitting here, actually, um, one of the reasons why I put, wanted to put this blind here is last year I had a bunch of deer out here at the end of October. But some of these, um, if you look at it, it looks fairly flat. But if you actually have or are sitting on the ground, like in an actual ground blind on the ground, you know, like they, like you would normally use a ground blind, um, there's some of these spots, like the pond over there, I couldn't see past the pond dam. Or like, there's just a few little low spots here and there. And I, I love the eye level look, but just getting a little bit higher off the ground you can see just a little bit better so I'm gonna try it out this year and see how it works and the nice thing about it is you don't have to leave your ground blind actually you know on the ground or anything you can actually leave it on this platform or you can take it off and put it back on or just you know whatever you want to do keep it out of the weather keep it from blowing off and a lot of people would probably think that you know it would probably blow off or anything and if if that's the case you can just take it off when you get done fold it up put it in your bag and you know head to the house but Anyway, I just wanted to show you this and kind of show you the area where I put it and uh, see what you think. There you have it. I mean, it's pretty simple. I mean, the way everything was built, I used my computer a little bit to help me get some measurements down as far as like how everything was going to fit. But other than that, I mean, as long as you get like a level spot to put it on the ground and you have a ground blind that's actually going to fit on, you know, the footprint of the, the size that you build the platform for. I mean, you can make it eight foot by eight foot if you wanted to, but... It kind of everybody's personal preference and what kind of size blind you're going to be putting on there. But hope you liked the video and uh, hope to see you on the next one. See you.